This tutorial is one of many instructional videos presented by Olympus Industrial Equipment. This tutorial video will provide you with detailed instructions for generating automated MIA or multiple image alignment within the Olympus Stream Image Analysis software. Automated MIA is available within Stream Motion or Enterprise. To begin, you will need to be within the Acquisition tab. You should have a live image on the main screen. The Stage Navigator tool window should also be open through the View menu drop-down to generate the MIA. To create a more uniform stitched image, utilizing a manual exposure or locking the exposure and shading correction is required. Within the Stage Navigator tool window, you have two options to set the region of area to be stitched for MIA. The first is to use point and click, which allows you to click and drag a selection area right on the overview image within the stage navigator. The second is to physically drive the stage to two opposing points to define the area. For this example, choose point and click. After you select point and click, you will have to zoom into the overview image by using the scroll wheel on the mouse. This will allow you to mark the area of interest with more precision. The overview image is a low magnification image of the entire stage or sample. Once you have zoomed into the area of interest, you simply point and click then drag the selection box around the area to be stitched for the MIA. Once the area is selected, the software will zoom back out to show you the overall location of your selection. If you use the scroll wheel on the mouse again, you can zoom back into the area to determine how many fields of view will be captured to generate the MIA. Once you have confirmed the area is set, you will need to select the Process Manager tool window. Within the Process Manager tool window, you will want to make sure to select Automatic Processes. Within the Automatic Processes are EFI, Extended Focal Imaging, MIA, multiple image alignment, time lapse imaging, and the software autofocus function. For this training, select the MIA button, although Stream is capable of capturing EFI and MIA images within the same scan. Within the MIA process window, you have several buttons and options. There is the ability to add stage locations to the overview image, generate a new selection area by opposing stage positions, ability to show the stage navigator tool window and turn on or off the focus map. You can also select to overwrite the acquired positions to clear old scans and capture all new. The software can ignore any Z changes or focus changes that may happen during the scan. You can choose to use the focus map or hardware autofocus if the system has this option. To begin the process, simply select the start button. You will notice the Process Manager tool window change once the scan is started. The software will generate a new document that starts blank and will fill in while the scan takes place. At any point, you can pause or stop the scan. During the scan, you can watch the progress at the bottom left of the screen or cancel it at any time. Once the image is completed, you will have a stitched image that is calibrated and ready to take measurements on and can be saved in any image format or inserted into a report. In this instructional video, we have covered automated MIA within the Olympus Stream Image Analysis software. We hope this video has been beneficial and we invite you to contact us directly with any questions.